Now I'm going to show you how to do one of the two types of factory reset. This one is normally called the soft factory reset. And for the Galaxy S7 and S7 Edge, we're going to need to launch the settings. And we need to scroll all the way down until you see the backup and reset option. Tapping on that backup and reset option, we're going to scroll down again. To the bottom, you should see a factory data reset. We're going to tap on that. This is a little information telling you what is going to be erased when you do a factory reset. After you've read the message, go ahead and tap on reset phone. Now, if you have a pattern or pin or passcode here, you will be asked to input that security layer just so Samsung and Android knows it's you who is doing the factory reset, not somebody who has stolen your phone and wants to reset it. You're going to need to tap on that delete all button and then it will reboot Android. It will reboot the Galaxy S7 and then start the soft factory reset. This process can take a few minutes. You'll need to wait until the process is done and then your Galaxy S7 will reboot back into Android. But you'll be at the regular Android activation screen. So you'll need to connect your Google account, sign back into your Samsung account if you have one, and then re-download and restore all of the applications that you normally use from the Google Play Store.